Hi there. You're in the lab with your mate JJ. Today we've got a, um, an unboxing. It's a pretty exciting day. I've had a, um, a package arrive from a friend. He's got some stuff he needs me to try and fix for him. So we'll look at that. But uh, we're not going to look at that today. We'll look at that sometime in the future. Today <coughs> we are going to unbox our new camera. Uh, and and the wall mount that goes with it. So uh, uh, we'll have a look at that. We'll we'll unbox it. Uh, then you can leave it with me, and I'll um, uh, install it. And then uh, once it's installed, we can create in the next video uh, to check it out. I, I got a camera with a lens that can zoom, so I uh, I should be able to show you when I'm working on my workbench, give you a detailed view. Um, so I, uh, I, I, I figure we have to crawl before we walk, so I did just get a cheapo, uh, camera, it's only a few hundred bucks, you could easily spend a few grand, there, there's a lot of options out there for, uh, for cameras, um, but I just got the cheapest one I could find, well, not quite the cheapest one, but one that seemed to, uh, tick all of the boxes, should be good enough, I reckon, for my, or our purposes, so, uh, we'll see. But uh, first of all, let's open up uh, our our package that arrived from Amazon today. I found a little uh, wire here. I really do worry about loose wires on my bench because they uh, they are a short circuit waiting to happen. So we're just gonna need some tweezers. There he is. And in we go. Ripper. Okay. Well, here's the package. Can you see that? I might switch switch you over to another view while we do this, huh? Let's try that one. Okay. So you can see me, and you can see the package and uh, we'll open it up. Excuse me while I finish my coffee. You want your uh, electronics nerds properly caffeinated. And here we go. Now we're going to need a knife. I'm a bit too far away from my trusty knife. Have you seen Dave Jones's knife he's got this monster I think he was inspired by crocodile Dundee um, you know that's not a knife this is a knife I'm pretty sure that's what uh, our mate Dave Jones is riff riffing on so here we go can you see that this is the camera there it is there and then I got two two wall mount kits. I wasn't sure which one to get, so I, I got the cheap one and I got the more expensive one. And I think they're about <coughs> they're about the same size. So uh, this one Archon mounts. There we go. And this one uh, I don't know. Alright, so, well, I'm glad I got both, because that looks like a piece of crap, so we won't even look at that at the moment. Let's pop this guy open. Now, they do say, never cut what can be untied, don't they? So, let's just take the uh, um, paper clips out of this guy. I, uh, I tend to keep all of the packaging that my equipment comes in. I've, I've got a folder full of old packaging. I'll show you that in a minute. Um, so I'll, I'll keep that. Um, I'll keep this uh, packaging and cardboard and everything. I'll keep that in my um, in my folder. I'll show you my folder in a minute. It's actually my, I think it's my third folder, might even be my fourth folder, when they get full I, uh, I just store them up on my shelf, 
you can't see my shelf um, on any of the cameras that I've got here at the moment but uh, it's there it's over behind me there so this is the Archon mounts camera drill base mount with multi-angle arm wonderful and this bag is not a toy I think we got that message <coughs> okay and then this bag probably not a toy either oh, and it's been sealed there we go all right I've got a really great pair of scissors scotch scissors titanium I got a three pack I've got I've got scissors everywhere which is what you want if you uh, are putting together an electronics lab for yourself make sure you get good scissors I can definitely recommend scotch titanium I got a three pack I've got a pair of them on every bench uh, so there we go there's a few screws this looks like uh, uh, this is just an ad for the for the manufacturer fair enough now let's see how this goes uh, I don't know I don't know if it's big enough I don't know if I put it up there maybe or maybe not I don't know anyway that's our Archon mount I'll have to think about it I might need to use some other technique uh, I don't know still thinking about that one yeah all right well, that's the Archon mount. I'll just uh, take him. <coughs> yeah, right. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to use a different mount. That's just not long enough. It won't stick out far enough. But that's no problem. I've got options. So we'll put that over there. All right, now this is the main game for today. Our, um, our digital camera. It doesn't even have a model number. It's just a, a Yamcha digital camera from China. Um, so I guess uh, we should pop him open and, and see what it looks like. Uh, it might be a case. It might be a case of buy cheap, buy twice, because uh, this might not work at all. <laughs> um, but it might, and if it does, um, that will help us limp along on this channel a bit longer, doing hopefully more interesting videos. Please format the memory card before using this video camera. Fair enough. So, here we are. Uh, we've got... USB-C to USB-A okay and we've got a wrist strap that's going straight in the second drawer I uh, I won't be needing that I've got a, a sand disk 32 gig and they did say to format it first so fair enough I don't think I'll be needing it though aha this is the lens I have no experience I've never used a lens like this before in my life so yeah interesting I don't know how it works I guess we'll figure it out um, and this there we go the camera itself wonderful and a little bit of bubble wrap left over. We don't need that. So there's the camera. And uh, this is the um, mini to micro SD card. Yep, 
That's fair enough. I don't. I'll plug it in if I have to. But uh, oh wow, look at this. Oh, it's it's uh it's big because it's in many languages. Um, but that's that's good. It's encouraging that it's got a manual. English, Spanish, German, French, Italian, and Japanese. Six languages. Get to know your camera. All right. Well, the manual looks pretty uh, pretty helpful, actually. That's good. It's in English, so I can read it. Wonderful. Uh, and it tells you how to uh, operate the camera. Okay. Uh, you can change the language setting. There you go. Uh, all right. Anyway, I'm just going to, um, you know, plug it in and see if I can figure it out. <coughs> I, uh, I won't read that camera there with you now. Now this looks like a battery. It is. Okay. So this is a lithium ion battery. That should be pretty easy to figure out. Attention please. For improved camera op compatibility, when you insert SD card, the camera will prompt format please. Please press confirm button. NBD team. Okay. So I got that message twice. Oh, there we go. Look, that's neat. That's a nice touch. They gave us a lens cleaner. Wonderful. And then there's just ah oh, USB. Look, okay, that's nice. USB to to micro SD. So you can plug your uh, micro SD into your uh, computer. Cool. That was uh, wasn't expected. So. Now we just got to figure out how to get the lens caps off. Do they just pop off? They do just pop off. Wow, look at that. That's awesome. And what about this guy? Yep, he just screws off. And then... Oop, looks like he just screws in. There we go. There we go. All right. So we pop the lens cap off, and then that's how you uh, that's how you zoom in and out. I don't. Know. Oh, yep. Yeah. Okay, it comes right off. There we go. All right. Well. Um, now I can take the, um, the screen protector off and when I have this on the bench I'm going to want it like that I think so yeah that's how I'm going to want it like that and that there and, uh, and that there Let's keep that lens cap on so we don't damage the lens while we're installing this guy. And, uh, yeah, okay. Well, I'm going to figure out how to put that battery in. That looks like it's pretty easy. Let's pop the bit off here. And then the guy that goes in there. There we go. And there's the micro SD card. I might as well stick that in there as well, huh? So, uh, this looks like it's got a corner to open it up here. Can you see that? I'll have, um, once I've got this camera in, this one, the one that's here, will um, be this guy instead. So, you should have, uh, in the next video, an even better uh, view than what you've got at the moment. See this, I'll be able to zoom in on this. So, uh, looking forward to that. That's good. And uh, yeah, I'm still trying to figure out what are the best cameras and what's the most sociable sort of way to uh, to, to video to to record the videos for YouTube. Man, I can't get this thing off. I might just, uh, what about him? 
Yeah. What about him? Uh, let's just uh, like that. Okay. Well, I'll put this SD card in. I'm probably going to have to stop recording um, and set up a few cameras, and then uh, and then we can we can just do a demo of this new camera. Uh, so I suppose that'd be good. Now I'm not sure which way this guy goes. Maybe this way. Let's try it that way. Oop. Uh, I don't know. No, doesn't like going that way. Try this way. There we go. In we go. Wonderful. Clip. All right. Well, on the back of this guy is the the screw. So I'll 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 mount it on that, and then uh, we'll turn him on and and see how he goes. Now he's going to be powered I think there was a USB-C where is that? Open. I don't know why we'd want to open it. Huh. There it is there. Look at that. It's got a cap. Awesome. So uh, okay alright well, um, okay, well, I'm going to uh, stop the video now, and I'm going to plug this guy in, and when we come back online, we should be able to get a, 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 a feed from, from this guy, so uh, I'll do that now, and I'll, uh, I'll be back for you very soon. Bam! back. So I've uh, just spent a couple of hours <laughs> messing around with these cameras. Um, the, the, the short story is that the new camera I got is terrible. It's just this dodgy uh, USB 2, you know, low resolution, awful, terrible camera. And uh, it does have the zoom function. <laughs> so I can like zoom in but the resolution's awful. So, you know, you get a nice tight, you know, cropped, you know, thing, but it, you can't read it or see it or anything. So, um, because of that, I, uh, I just refactored what I've got and I've actually put my uh, Logitech Brio, that's what you can see here now with my hands on it. Um, and that's fairly good resolution. So you should be able to see, uh, the details on the on the mat here. I can't zoom it in and out, um, but it's fairly it's fairly close to the action. So this is going to be the 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 mat or the bench view, and I do actually have uh, the the new camera as you can see there, and that's it's up there. So it gives you a very expansive view. Of the room and I can actually even just drop my face off there and you can see that's the the whole uh, bench uh, it's not good resolution but it does give you the, the big picture um, and uh, and I've, I've got this view as well I, I'm not sure I don't know um, if I should have I don't know which one I should make the primary one maybe I don't know um, but that, that, that gives you uh, the view of me working plus the detail view here, so I'm not sure how good that is. Um, I, I noticed a few mistakes uh, in, the, in the earlier part of this video. I, uh, I just, I've, I've used Caden Live um, to put in some uh, corrections, so you would have seen those pop up with the little text box, so I, I'm slowly figuring things out. Um, anyway, this video is already a little bit long, and um, uh, I don't want to take up any more of your time. Uh, I'm just going to uh, publish this. This is the unboxing of my 
um, uh, HBD camera. Um, in the next video, we'll uh, we'll use our new setup, and we'll um, uh, have a look at the the trimmers that my mate sent me. I've got to replace some batteries on some hair trimmers, so we'll look at that. That's our next job, and we'll get to use our new cameras and uh, and and see how that goes. Anyway, that's it for now, and I'll see you next time.